it's blood. Yeah, as you can see, it's clear. So I'm it's sitting more, on the red yard. More in depth, and I can stop. Let me show you some time. Yeah, come over here. Put up the time. Went on this mattress. Took some shit out. Slid some shit back. And now it's eight nine in front of me. Yeah, we doing. We just talking shit. I'm in fucking Macy's, man. I just need a knife to protect myself. He said, well, God damn it, this is too big. Okay. Yeah. You know hey, what? Uh, no, yeah. no, no, no. Yo, Ian, good, all generous. Ian does in right. every episode is go. talk that negative Nancy shit. He's a chatty patty. Negative Nancy, bro. But look, he wants to be the face. Look, this fucker. No, no, where's this fucker? Right there. That fucker. Right there. Yeah, I see the big finger. Yeah. <laughs> this yeah. motherfucker. Right there. What's good yeah. with y'all? Him. This? It's part of our last episode. This is actually yeah. the last episode of the season. And uh, we, we're going to like wrap it up by sort of like giving a reflection of what we've learned as the events yep. as the episodes keep rolling. Yep. So on that episode, you guys, five, four, three, two, one. Ready? Let's go. <laughs> yes. This what we're gonna come to y'all tonight with. We are gonna tell y'all what we learned, you know, um, what helped yeah. us, a couple of things. I'm gonna go first, you know. I don't talk too much. Y'all probably see me behind the scenes, you know. I'm the one that be doing all the blah, 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 when the intros come on. That's me, you know, ad libbing it, you know, getting getting right. Variety um, and program. And what but, I but you're more than just that, do you? Yeah. Uh, you you edit the shows, right? Yeah, I do. The, I do the editing. Yeah. Well, also, pictures y'all, are showing I do. Up. Yeah, pictures, <laughs> editing, and I have y'all see something on there. I do all of that stuff. You know, I take my time to do all of that because I love doing it. Um, I love you. What I've learned just from the show alone, I learned how to do audio better. Yeah. I learned how to do video better. Yeah. I learned how to do visual better. Yeah. So now I can take. Just simple phrases and turn them into a whole two, three, four, five minute video. You know, just been spinning it. But as a person now. Okay. As a person. I personally, my 130 second. <laughs> and personally, what I've learned is patience. Because <laughs> when you edit it, you got to have patience. And you also have to have um, attention to detail. If you don't have attention to detail, you will be a subpar editor. But if you got attention to detail and the ear for sound, that that combines to be a really good a really good formula for editor. So all y'all editors out there, make sure you get your ears right and your eyes right. I mean, that really goes for any type of profession or any type of craft or skill where True. you gotta have that attention to detail. That's that's how you become better. True. Yeah. So that's what I'm doing. That's how what made me better as a person. And also, um, the extra knowledge, because I learn things from, I try to learn something every day. I was taught to, when you wake up in the morning, make sure you learn something new or make sure you add on to what you learned from yesterday. So when I wake up, I try to learn something every single day. And my basic propensity for knowledge has came back. So I'm just like a little kid in the candy shop right now. You know what I mean? So what about that's what character? I don't know, but characters, ah. As Character. a person, that's what I'm saying. As a person, not studio, not technology. Oh, no, as I, we grew, remember, it's, this was tax season. Week went ups, downs, jobs, life. Oh yeah, that's what I'm saying. We were, yo, season one, we recorded in a carport yeah. that none of us lived in, we, just we, so we, we can put on record. Just so we can do it. But what I learned as a person is, everybody comes from different backgrounds. You have to respect those backgrounds, and that teaches you a lot more civility. With people too like that, so man. you have to get you have to humanize yourself to some situations and all that good stuff so that's what i learned i'm a good for y'all so that's what my thing is we 
I'm going to pass the mic to my dog Ian next, boy. Y'all know how we do. The we cut, boy. Hold on, I thought we were cutting up. the episode. I thought we were cutting the episodes off of <laughs> What's up, y'all? It's Ian Edge, right? So I'm going to talk a little bit about how I progressed as a person doing this podcast, right? So why are you sitting down in the chair? Yo, I thought you were editor. Yo, who are you? You were supposed to be behind the scenes. Who is this guy? God damn. Yo, man, I'm I'm doing my confession. There you go, y'all. Okay, y'all. There you go. All right, so I can't even have my own confession. All right, that's fine. All right, bye. (laughs) So anyways, so through through the show, I really learned a lot about myself, right? Uh, In all reality, I've always been a degenerate gen, but I never ever put a name to it like i never gave it like a title of you know what made me me right he ian y'all yeah and, and to be completely honest like, <laughs> i'm probably still the same dude mm. but <laughs> but that doesn't mean i pancake I'm not batter willing. is still a pancake bro. look i'm 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 not saying <laughs> that i'm not willing to change my ways but I need that right person to like sway, oh God. Mm. sway me, sway, sway my thoughts, <laughs> right away from the thoughts. <laughs> now, uh, through the show, like I, I really took an inner look into myself, and I, I really discovered a lot of things that I even still need to improve on. But yet, I feel like it's it's a lot better now because. I'm at least aware of it, and that that turns into real progress whenever you're aware of your own mistakes. That is true. And who you truly are. You can't run away from yourself. Nope. Right? You can keep running and running and running, but you can't run away from yourself. You really can't. Nope. I don't know. Mm-hmm. Bob Marley mm-hmm. talked that. <laughs> like, I can't even, can't even take me seriously right now. It's like, it's like you're in my frame. Oh my yeah. God. <laughs> All right, you guys. Hello. Uh, my name's Theo Badass. No, this is actually ENC, and I'm just taking 30 seconds of this clip because that's a guarantee that we have to give. We have three second guarantees of 30 second clips on each I'm already one. hating it. <laughs> anyway. And there's Dion. Aren't you supposed to be in the back? Somewhere? No, he has. Uh, that, that's just his first thirty second clip. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> All right, back to you. Yeah. So, anyways, uh, now that they stole a little bit of the shine, that's all right. That's all right. I love. I have I love two all more. Of them. Well, actually, I have one more. I, I love all of them. So, uh, can I share one so with much? you? Can I share your last one? Yeah. So we both have two more. Okay. Just cool. You know. Okay. <laughs> so, anyways, uh, I, I know that you guys listen to a lot of my stories and all of them were true uh but you know there comes a time in your life when, whenever you realize that you know all those like one night stands and all that doesn't matter anymore because at the end of the day who, who's really looking out for you right like yeah sure you got your bros right you got your you got your brothers and sisters you know even those that ain't even related to you you're degenerates yep yeah because see i don't even have any siblings uh so i you got me man. well maybe it's like we we siblings but we ain't blood i don't have any blood siblings that's because you wear blue my bitch okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, all right no, we totally ripped yeah off this. yeah exactly ah, like you know like you, you guys are having too much fun it's you know i'm done with yo, this it's because we love you yo no 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 it's because we love you bro Yo, why don't you get in the frame? Hey. Not you. What's up? Hold on, I thought that was a countdown. Nah, there ain't oh, no nah, countdown. Yeah, 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 we're ready. <laughs> <laughs> He's stupid. Look at, the, look at the camera like that, man. <laughs> this thing. Uh, <laughs> okay. Okay. Look at your eyebrow. Oh my your God. eyebrow was take raised. Uh, like, no. take, yeah. All right, we back, yeah. Come on, dude. Okay. Right. It is a moist evening. Yes. Yeah. Well, I mean, it always is. Yeah, it is. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> He's like talking. 
We all right. <laughs> all right, y'all. We back. Yeah, we back Again. to it. All right, Theo, do you have something you want to share? Theo, you sound like a high school guidance counselor. <laughs> no, well, I'm just trying to get you to open up. You were man. trying not to laugh. Okay, Look well, at Look at I'm, yeah. I'm good. Yeah, I'm I, good. I, I want you... To, to look at our viewers. Express yourself. <laughs> look at this nigga. <laughs> I'm sorry. All right. I'm sorry. All right. Mm-hmm. We back. Right. Um, two things that happened. Um, I honestly thought I was making a. Honestly thought. People in the background are disrespectful. I honestly thought that we were making a entertaining, just a satire type of podcast, and then when. The two major episodes that happened to me was, honestly, episode one, the introduction. And there was three. Episode two, and not episode two, but the next episode, like, the, my second favorite episode was the Anthony Bourdain episode. Mm-hmm. Because I actually released the fact that I, too, myself deal with bipolar disorder, which is I. You know, like, and if yeah. you listen to the episodes, you'll understand. It's not really a serious thing. I mean, it, it basically means, like... You're a zebra hanging out with horses. Yeah. You got what I'm saying? Yeah. Just different. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Different. Mm-hmm. And it's just like to the horses, you're a you're a horse like them. You know, you yeah. you yeah. look like them, you look like them, but you wonder why you don't look like them. While we're we're not sweating and this guy is sweating bullets. <laughs> <laughs> hey. that, anyway, that's how we point we you out as being a zebra. Back. Yep. Um zebra. It's social anxiety, okay? And I actually know the numbers, right? We're going to work on that. Yeah, that, was, that was the first 30 seconds. Okay, yes, and you yeah, weren't. Was, oh, that was mm-hmm. a good one. Yeah. We knew it. Yeah, okay. we love Theo, so we plot on him. We're going to let him explain himself because we love him. Go ahead, Theo. Mm-hmm. 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 And we're back. All right. And actually, the, the second one is... <laughs> A second there. XXX Tentacion, his passing, and realize at the age of where he was and the talent he had, and yeah. what we're doing, and the, the blessing that we had to actually have more years because we all are older than him. Yeah. Everybody on this podcast is older than him. And what was he, 20? Yes. Yeah. He, he didn't have a chance to expand. You yeah. understand? He didn't. That was another thing that inspires me to do this. And the other thing, shout out for a follow up subscription, but Jesus and Meru actually got picked up on Showtime. Hey. From Viceland, which oh actually, no, let's, uh, can we just, let's just. That is our Rocky movie. We're not swagger jacket or nothing, but that's just something where it like inspires us. That's yeah. like, that's like a stripper watching a uh, player's club or like yeah, no, a totally boxer good. watching Rocky or, you know, an MMA fighter watching Warrior. Right? Yeah, it shows like a bit of an origin story. You yeah. Know, yeah. These, these guys were yeah. loved before they were were picked up yeah. by Showtime. Yeah. And now they're doing it once a week for way a lot. Yeah, way you know, more. We're not going to get into that. Yeah. We're not going to get into that. Yeah, but Vicelands, they still got love for Viceland, though, which is good. I like dipping out of the camera. That seems to be my thing right now. <laughs> it's my brother. <laughs> we dip it up. All right. <laughs> yeah, y'all. So... Yo, mm-hmm. let's see if we can do. Know. Yo, okay, let's hold on for a second. I want to spend one thirty second time thread on mine. Can we try to do the triple head stack on one side like this, like on Scooby Doo? Let's do it. Come on, get up, everybody, break up. Come on, let's go on one side. Come on, ready? Come here, everybody, let's show up on one side. No, you come over here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come over here. Oh, you want a sandwich? Like he goes down, you go in the middle, and I go on top. Sure. Okay, ready? Okay, Dion, yeah, you on the bottom? You have you you in the middle? I'm on top. Ready? Go. You come on the bottom. Line it up right. Go. Okay. This is really weird. <laughs> That's weird. That's weird. <laughs> <laughs> That's weird, y'all. But y'all know what we're talking about, man. This is generous, y'all. We, this is how we is. This is how we do. Season two, oh, y'all finna, y'all gotta get strapped in, boy. It's like a car. We actually like have a studio. 50. There's a pool table involved. There's a hookah bar involved. Yeah. There's a barbershop involved. And there's yeah. a tattoo shop involved. On you guys. Yeah. I mean, mm-hmm. we actually have a playland. Yeah, and you thought we were playing, and wait till season two. Mm. 
Well, yeah. I may not see Miss Chrissy here. That's because she she's a mom and she takes oh, care no, of Oh, no, no, Miss Chrissy is busy. That's what but, we know. Um, oh, please. She's please definitely believe. locked in. She's here. She's going to be all over this video when y'all finally see it. Can we say this right now? We That's actually baby. did call her. Yep. And she told us she took her hair out. Yeah. She's watching mm-hmm. her kids. Yep. She got no time. For- <laughs> and we know how y'all women is. And we Can't totally understood. <laughs> yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I got a 19-year-old daughter, so I know what y'all talking about. Oh, Miss right. Chrissy, we got you, baby. But until then, y'all, hey, we just in a gents, man. My name is D. Witty. Yo, badass. And Ian Edge. And that's what happens when you combine three intelligent men and a woman, sorry, Chrissy, and do a podcast. You get degenerate gents and Jane's boy. Mm-hmm. Yeah, we but out it's for really now. like a bad idea because we just have the most horrible decisions. Don't we? Yeah. Oh my God. We accepted them all. Though. I mean, I don't want my kids to do. Oh my God. If I can. Hey. Oh my. DeAndre, you better not. <laughs> <laughs> we out.